guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, my name is Antoinette, I'm a New Zealander living in Germany and this video is going to be a little bit different from my typical videos. I'm actually going to be sharing with you some of my favourite German beauty products and the cool thing about these products is that they are super cheap, they're all under 4 euros I think and if you know me, you'll know that I love a good bargain and I don't like to compromise on quality though, but I like to find really cheap things that work really, really well. I was not always like this, I was quite the opposite actually, and when I look back now, I cringe at how much money I wasted on stupid products. And I think it all started when I lived in Melbourne, I was 21 years old, and I felt like I had to sort of keep up with this image and by keeping up with this image I had to spend a lot of money on beauty products and I don't know it was just a really bad trap and I remember I would only have MAC makeup which is really expensive I felt like I always needed to get salon shampoo for my hair to look nice um, I would spend a lot of money on perfume and things like fake tan I used to love to fake tan so then when I moved back to New Zealand to finish off my university studies I went from working and being able to buy all of these fancy products to being a full-time student having no money and I had to dramatically cut down on products so when I moved to Germany I was absolutely blown away by how cheap some of the products were here and I tried out so many different products because I was like so excited about the prices of everything and I realized that there were a lot of really good products in Germany and through trial and error I found some really like solid products okay so the first product that I absolutely love I've been using it for years it is a face wash by a brand called Alva D I think that's how you pronounce it which is a line from DM which is like a huge drugstore here in Germany it's like a chain it's actually a natural cosmetic line and a lot of their products are plant-based and they're made with a lot of natural ingredients and products like this in New Zealand and Australia are so expensive like you would be paying I don't know 30 New Zealand dollars for this face wash but um, I love this face wash it is very light um, it takes off makeup really really well I don't break out with it because I'm prone to breakouts and I just love it it's got a really nice smell it's just it's a good face wash and another product that I love that I swear by is a moisturizer by the same brand the natural cosmetic line and it is a daily moisturizer and it's really really light it's not sticky it's not greasy it's just like the perfect moisturizer and it's the kind of moisturizer I can use before I put on my makeup I love that it's a natural cosmetic line so a lot of these ingredients are plant-based and they're not going to be full of chemicals and that kind of thing so super good brand I'm not a fan of their shampoos I tried them out and they're not that good they don't suit my hair but as far as the moisturizers and the face washes super good you can't go wrong another product that I absolutely love is this fake tan and it is also from DM and I'm not a huge fake tanner anymore I used to be I'll sometimes wear it at the beginning of summer when I'm really really pasty and and I was really reluctant to try this because it is so so cheap and as I mentioned in Melbourne when I was living in Melbourne I always had to wear the Saint Tropez fake tan which I'm pretty sure was like $60 crazy price I feel like this is almost as good it is such a good fake tan it's a really nice natural kind of brown color it's not orange at all no one even knows that I'm wearing fake tan or if they do they don't say anything but I feel like it's super natural you can even put it on your face and it doesn't look orange and I feel like it lasts for quite a while so this one is called Sun Dance so I highly recommend this fake tan okay the next product is also by Alva D it looks a little bit dirty because I use it all the time but it is this makeup palette here and it's just got lots of really nice kind of like browny pinky shades um, some of them have a little bit of not glitter but sheen and um, I just really love I love the colors and um, it's also like the natural cosmetic brand so it's not made with all these harsh chemicals and um, I just think it's a really really good eyeshadow palette and um, it's very very cheap a really good makeup palette that I've been using for a long time another product that I love is actually by Lidl the supermarket Lidl and it is a body wash and it's by the brand how do you pronounce this Kine Kine I think what a weird name but anyway it's just a really good body wash and it's a sensitive body wash 
um, and it doesn't really have much of a smell it's just very very subtle the smell and I think that's what I love about it because I'm prone to breakouts so I can't use lots of perfumes like really harsh perfumes in my body washes or moisturizers so that's why I love this one it's a really decent size how much is it? it's like 500 milliliters and um, I just think it's a good body wash it's kind of moisturizing too it doesn't dry out my skin it's not harsh and I can even use it on the kids and you know kids have really sensitive skin but they do not react to this body wash okay so the last one is actually a perfume and this is by the brand Sprit and um, they have a few different types of this perfume this one is Sprit of Lovely Flowers so it's a floral scent I usually wear Vera Wang perfume because I love the floral scent and I'm just all about like the feminine floral scent and um, Vera Wang is so expensive but I always keep buying it especially when I am at the airport I always get it duty free because it is a little bit cheaper and then I thought okay I'm just going to try out some cheaper perfumes just to see if they smell any good so I went into D I picked up this one and I saw it had flowers on it so I thought okay I'm gonna give it a try and I was so surprised by how good it smells and I feel like if somebody had told me this was a hundred euro bottle of perfume I would I would actually believe them so I'll wear my Vera Wang perfume if I go out somewhere really fancy which I hardly ever do but um, during the day I don't want to waste that you know it's expensive so I use this one it is so so good and I highly recommend you guys giving it a try I know some people might feel a little bit weird about wearing perfume that cost under four euros but I honestly do not care and I have people ask me all the time what perfume are you wearing you smell so good and I usually say uh, I can't actually remember I think it's my Vera Wang and they're just like oh okay so guys that was kind of like a confession video the cheap product that I use but honestly I am not going to compromise quality I only use them because they're really good and I have tried out a lot of other cheap products which were not good but these are just ones that happen to make the cut and I wanted to share them with you guys because who doesn't like a bargain you know if you know of any really cheap but really good German products then please share them with me in the comments below and once again this is not a sponsored video I have no connection with any of these companies I just really love these products I wanted to share them with you all so thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed this video then don't forget to give it a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel feel free to follow me on Instagram and I'll see you again really soon bye